Hey, in this video, I show you how to make Texas Hotlings, a pretty famous sausage from barbecuing. I hope I do it right. <laughs> First of all, you need some beef, then also pork belly. Because you can use beef brisket, make sure that it's not too fatty because of the pork belly. So it should be not above 30% fat. Then for the spices, we have salt and cure some black pepper then i have some garlic powder onion powder paprika then cayenne pepper and finally some mustard seeds i would say let's start with the process first of all we cut the meat into cubes or strips that fit your meat grinder and as you can see here while i'm cutting what I mean with the fat ratio, if you have like a fatty pork belly and also have a fatty piece of beef, then it can be too much fat. So we'll just make sure that you're not above 30% fat to 70% lean meat ratio. Once you cut everything, you can put it in the freezer to get nice and cold before we grind it. For grinding, I'm using the medium perforated disc and I grind it through once. It is a coarser sausage, however, if you like it finer, then yeah, you do you, just grind it finer. And once everything is ground up, we can then add the spices and mix everything well together. This is important because you want to have a nice binding in the sausage, otherwise it will crumble later on. So yeah, make sure that you mix everything well and in the end it is nice and sticky. Then it's time to fill the sausages. I'm using Hawk Casings Calibre 2830. And then you can twist them off in your desired length. I like them a bit shorter. Just put them between your fingers, rotate forward, skip one sausage and do it again. And now it's time for smoking. I personally hang them in the smoker at around 50 degrees Celsius without any smoke for 20 minutes to let them dry out. And then I add the smoke and also increase the heat to 70 degrees Celsius and smoke them for at least two hours. No poaching afterwards. They should be nice and plump, have a nice color and the internal temperature should be around 65 degrees Celsius, around two hours or two and a half hours. And here you can see because it's smoked so long, it has this nice and rich color and taste wise, it's nice, juicy, snappy and all the spices come out. It has a nice level of heat, can totally recommend the sausages. It's, it's amazing. Full recipe, as always, is below. If you like this video, then please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.